Hello everyone, welcome to the vlog. Today is Sunday, August 25th, I believe. We're on our way to my son's scrimmage. Um, this is the first college scrimmage. It's at Guy Uday in DC. Monday the 26th I'm at the park about to take my walk and yeah I'm about to take my walk and I'm just gonna do try to do my little three miles if I can get in more I will <sighs> my goodness I'm done oh I'm getting my watch I got 3.07 miles in 54 minutes Pay average pace was 17 minutes and 44 seconds. I'm going to be honest. I was not. Oh, shoot. I was not really <clears throat> feeling the workout today. Um, just wasn't. But I was like, I got to do it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to start my week off. I've missed too many days. Hey, everyone. What's today? Today is Wednesday, August 28th. I just uploaded, well, the last vlog is uploading. I took a couple of days off, I think, because I was like, uh, I think I'm overdoing it. And right now I'm on my way to Walmart to get some cleaning supplies. I'm looking for a Mod Podge, I think that's what it is. Because uh, like a lot of my jewelry is not really real. Anyway, but I'm headed to Walmart and I'm going to my local Walmart. I'm not going to Virginia today to the Walmart because I, this is just closer. I'm supposed to be having lunch with a friend today. I don't know because I do have like a lot of things to do. This is my last day off. I've been off. The last day I worked was Saturday. So today's Wednesday. This is my last day off. I kind of like to want to enjoy it and I kind of want to get back in. I don't want to get back in too late. Also, I need to film some planner content for sure. For sure, for sure. Some planner content. And I'm trying to think. It was something else. Like, you know how when you really don't have a lot of money and there's so many things you want to do or things that you need, you cannot. You, you just can think of all this stuff. But when you have a little bit of extra money you can't think of nothing but all i could think of today was i needed laundry detergent just household things i just don't want those things to run low again i'm good like on dishwasher pods things like that um of course bills oh that reminds me i need to get my truck service um i need to get some more rotors that's what my car been shaking 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 so i need to call the guy back and um he said he could take me saturday morning but I'm gonna see if he can take me on Friday, so I know I need to kind of give him a day notice. So that way, I'm gonna see if he can take me tomorrow. That way, um, we can go ahead and just get that out of the way. I've been riding around like this for too long. I got a couple road trips I need to take, so we need this done. Run uh, some errands to the Walmart, and um, I wasn't gonna go to Target because I would kind of prefer to go to Target. Hmm, should I go to Target? You know what? Uh, nope. Target. This will be my turn to go to Target. Am I going to go to Target or to this raggedy Walmart? <sighs> I really like Target. We're going to Target. <laughs>
Okay, you guys, I am back. Ooh, it's 94 degrees today. I'm out of the Target. Guess what I got? Um, well, first off, I wanted to try these chips. At my husband's job, they give out like free snacks and they try to do like healthy snacks. So they had some of these, but in the nacho cheese flavor. I had them yesterday, didn't make me feel any type of way. So I was like, well, let me try the lime because I'm a lime tortilla eater. Anyway, as y'all saw, I got some more of these. Oh, now I did put some stuff back because like the lotion, I still have some, I got enough to hold me over. And then, you know, I don't know why I can't spend no money when I can, like it's just whatever got me some more purse gloss like I was missing my gloss so let me put this here so I can let me take that out of here because I was surely missing my gloss and I couldn't even find the one I had at home so let me do that Woo! thank you Jesus she back I think she fell out at the park or something uh, I love aquaphor anyway um, I got some mod Podge. I got this because I saw a girl on TikTok talk about putting it on your jewelry, like your costume jewelry. And I have a few pieces of costume jewelry and I want to keep them. And that would be my issue. Like, I'm allergic to nickel and I'm allergic to a lot of stuff. But um, I don't know where the sunlight is coming in. But uh, some don't break me out. But I want to try it on some things that I like that uh, may break me out as well. Yo, I found, listen. Ugh. Oops, Oops. Anyway, I got the plates. <laughs> okay, I got four of these plates, and I'm like, my husband's gonna kill me. When I go home, he's gonna be like, well, what you gonna do with the other plates? So the other plates, I'm just gonna put up. I don't really be entertaining like that, like I used to. And I thought about it, like if I do have to entertain, I'm put the other ones either in my storage cabinet and then I have a storage closet downstairs. I could put them in uh, just in case, you know, just in case these break, we don't have any more. And I have a good mind to give the other ones away because I really believe my other plates, they're white. I got them from like the thrift store. Uh, oh, hold on. Let me put that back. And I'm, I'm gonna try these. Also, I got more of these because this is my favorite. The ranch used to be my favorite, baby. No, this is my favorite because it gives Dorito. It gives me the Dorito too. And then I said, wait a minute, what is this? Sour cream and onion, sour cream and onion. And I meant to, um, I need to sanitize. I meant to pick up me a little um, Olipop so that I could have something to taste with and chase with, but it's okay. It's all right. Um, but yeah, so now I want to go over to Marshall's, y'all. I'm just going to look at the jury. I heard someone talk about the jury. And then now I got the Marge Podge, but I, I don't even want to spend no more money. I've supposed to been going to lunch with a friend. I don't even want to go no more. I don't even want to go no more because I don't want to spend any money. Prayerfully, y'all can see this, but we got a new camera. And I'm excited. Let's open it. Oh, gosh. I was like, you've been doing good. <laughs> and we want the quality to be right. So I read the reviews. I've actually had not this one, but the ZVE in my cart for quite some time. So I came across this one as I was looking. Record. And let's see what this is. <sighs> I was like, oh, what is this? It's the mic, I believe. I think it's the mic. It's the mic. And they said this is a great starter camera, so yeah. And I wanted something small. I didn't want anything too big. I've had a big camera before. And like I said, I gave that one. I had the Canon Rebel, and I used to use that on my beauty channel. But this is a great vlogging camera, and I think that I can use this um, 
Oh, oh, this is battery thing. Why is this flying open? I don't think this is supposed to come open. Okay, I had to turn the camera back around because um, the lighting was doing something strange. Okay, there's a lock on this. That's why that kept coming open. I hate that this isn't showing up well. So I took out the battery. I put the battery in. And then... Oh. Oh, maybe I gotta put this a little... If you haven't noticed, I'm one of them people, I don't really read instructions. <laughs> I was like, when I was reading the reviews, they said the battery dies really fast. So you need to back up battery. And so these are the accessories I got. I got also um, a memory disc. I thought I picked up the one for two. 56 or 256 gigabyte but i got the 128 gigabyte um let's see now i'm gonna find where that goes and i got extra batteries i think this is a three pack of batteries oh so we got that And you charge the batteries on this. I don't want to use it. So you put the batteries on here and you charge them. Uh, but you need the USB thing. Mm, okay. Uh, that should have been one of the things. I need some more USB cords. So I'm going to put these in here. I'm going to probably take it to work with me and just read up on it and study it. So I probably won't be vlogging with it when I go to the dealer, not the dealership, to the mechanic. And then I got this. It is like a card reader, so I can take the memory, put it in here. I have one for my phone, but it's like for a USB port or something like that. So I can put this one into my phone. Because sometimes I do, I don't know if I need this. I don't know if I need this. But anyway, yeah. What is that? <laughs> I think I figured it out. And then here's my laptop. Because I wanted to put it into my MacBook because I use, yep, it fits into my MacBook. Oh, and then it has this one here so you won't lose it. Yeah. So now I'll probably be able to edit in my MacBook opposed to my phone. Okay, makes sense. And I'm back. <laughs> Ooh, it's too early. It's too early. So I gotta go to the bank first before I go to, um, I gotta go get the money out to pay him in cash. He don't have a machine. He said he just got it last week. But, yeah, so I got to go to the bank first, and the bank isn't in my job, but it doesn't seem like he's too far from my job, according to the address. <sighs> like, I'm a morning person. I've actually been up since, like, 5.30, because, I, I don't know, I was just up. I've been waking up at 5.30, and, but I'm not functional <laughs> to be talking to people in people's face at 7 30 in the morning like i've always been a morning person and in my younger days i could communicate with people at 7 30 in the morning but the older i get i cannot be talking to people at 7 30 in the morning like i cannot be in people's face i cannot mm -mm, no. <sighs> i used to be at work doing hair at 5 30 6 o'clock in the morning could talk and mingle with folks <clears throat> I can't do that anyway I'm off that rant <clears throat> so let me 
get here because Betsy finally got to get fixed. But this ain't even her name. I don't even know my car name. Oh, she's a Tootsie Roll because she's the color of a Tootsie Roll. But Tootsie is finally going to get her some rotors, okay? So I can stop <laughs> shaking at the light. All right, I'm going to stop at the 7-Eleven and get me some water. I got my water cup, <clears throat> but I'm going to work afterwards. And I could have grabbed some waters from home, but I want a <clears throat> big thing of water. Excuse me. I want a big thing of water so that it'll last me kind of like throughout the day of refilling up. I fill my cup up with a lot of ice, and that way it just lasts me. So let me go in here at the 7-Eleven. Okay, we are at the mechanic. It is... 7.33. I made it here at 7.25. I wasn't thinking I should have brought my tennis shoes. And I keep saying I'm going to put an extra pair of tennis shoes in the car. So, I'm just going to do a a little walk, I think. Let me see. I got to look to see if it's a lot of sidewalk. Hold on. Because, y'all, I don't know if I told you. There ain't a whole lot of sidewalk. I don't know if I told you, but I pulled a hamstring, I believe, the back of my thigh. And so I hadn't worked out like in two days. So I really want to get a walk in. But the thing is, I got on my flip flops. So I might just hold off. He does have a sit down area. So I might just go in here and sit down and drink my coffee. Alrighty, I'll chat with y'all in a little bit. And I'll let y'all know when Tootsie is ready. Um, What the heck? These two white doves just came from nowhere. I'm scared of birds. Please move. What the? I'm out here walking. Sir, excuse me. Uh, have a great day. Bye. Y'all, I'm just walking in this neighborhood near the shop where I'm getting my car fixed. Hold on. And out of nowhere, I'm hear some flapping and they're gone I had to get that on video so I was trying to walk in the area where the car the mechanic was but people were coming in and out and you know it's a bunch of men so I was like let me cross the street and I saw this neighborhood and I think one of my co-workers lives somewhere in this neighborhood so I said I'm just gonna Walk the neighborhood, so. What the, what is going on? Really? Why are y'all following me? I'm getting nervous. Look at them. I am nervous. They're making me nervous. <laughs> what, the, what on earth? What kind of sign is that? Somebody tell me. Cause I'm scared they go a damn squirrel. Oh my God. Are they walking in pairs? Are they lost? Oh my gosh. Like, what the heck? There they go. They're following me. They are following me. What? Oh Lord. I'm already scared of birds. I know y'all like your shit. You scared of bridges. You're scared of birds, you're scared of squirrels, mice. But baby, why? Why they follow me? Okay, I'm coming to like a court. So I'm just gonna switch around and go around. I'm almost to a mile, so, and 18 minutes. So I'm just killing time. But what the fuck? <laughs> Good morning, y'all. I wanna do a quick little haul. Um, this is a Walmart and Amazon haul. Um, I need to make it up there. I was gonna try to use my camera, but I'm using the front face of my phone because I need to find a piece for the camera to put on the tripod. Uh, but anyway, let's do um, uh, Amazon first. So I got me a strapless bra. Like I have some strapless bras, but they all either got designs on them. There's a beige, a couple of beige color. And I had a black one, but it just became too small, so I ordered a bigger one. Now, I used to wear a 38 double D, but of course it gained weight, so then I was like in a 40 double D. 
but I didn't know how he was going to run. So now I've lost weight. I'm probably back in a 38, a double D, but, um, yeah, I, um, I know this is a bit much. Yeah, you know what? So I got the 40 double D. I will try this, and this came, it was, it had like five stars or four stars on, four and a half stars on Amazon. So we're going to see how that goes. Okay, so we got the bar. Then I, I saw these purses on like Shein and stuff, but I was looking at another bag, like a slouch bag. These guys have dogs. I was looking at a slouch bag and this popped up. And I have a shirt, of course, just like this. And I thought it was a little wider. So this is like my little end of the summer bag. This one I do clutches and stuff like that, but perfect for fall as well. I'm gonna do this like with some all black probably. When the dogs hear me talking, they think I'm talking to somebody and they wanna come out. Okay, next up, Walmart. So y'all, if you don't know, I love army fatigue, especially in pants. Oh my gosh, I got a couple of pair, but I didn't have any cargos and they're wide leg. And so I was in Walmart and the other pants that I did last vlog and I was telling y'all about the wide legs, I got them from Walmart, they were a little too big. Those came out the teen section and I got those like in a 15, 16, I believe, maybe a 19 and they've gotten big. Now the camera does not <laughs> do my body justice. I look wider, but I've lost over 50 pounds since May and I got these because I know Walmart stuff run big. I got the, I mean, run small, excuse me. I got these in a 16, 18, uh, 16, 18, I hope y'all can see. And these are the no boundaries. And it has a little bit of stretch back here. I tried these on yesterday. That's why the tag is missing because when I went to go take them off, I hit the tag off. But y'all look at them, perfect for fall. The material feels really good and I was afraid these were going to be too small. Uh, no. When I put these on, <laughs> I had room and, again, I had to pull them up over my stomach. Now, they, I have butts. I have butts. So, it was a little snug around the butt, but that was perfect because that's the way, that's the way that, you know, I wanted them to kind of fit, but flat out. But in the thigh part, plenty of room, everything. So, I can't wait to wear these. I needed something for Saturdays. We don't have to wear black to work. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to get these in summer, the rest of the summer and fall. In the fall, I'm just trying to decide I may do a cute tennis shoe with it. Um, it's just so many things I can do with it. Then I saw this shirt and I was like, uh, I love green too. That's another thing. So I was like, well, I could do pair this shirt with this, right? And then I was like, I don't know if that goes together. This shirt was $2.98, right? And it's a little tank. So then I was thinking... I have my strapless bra and I don't have to wear the ones with because in case this is too thin the ones with the design and things like that under it it won't show through because I noticed I had something on last week and I wore my strapless bra and I could see the design through it so I proceeded to get just a regular tee like I love a good t-shirt I'm kind of realizing my style is comfortability <laughs> and t-shirts so I got this t-shirt. I said, oh, that would go perfect. You know, it's still a little greener than I would like, but, you know, cool. If it, It's, you know, I'm thinking more beigey with that, um, those pants. And I know I have a beige top. I have a lot of neutrals because I love neutrals. So, get to the register. This is all I had. These three things. And then the lady called over an associate and, or well, whatever, a manager. And she was like, these are dollars. And I said, excuse me? And she was like, she's they ringing up as a dollar. So the lady said, oh, let me go look. Like it was supposed to have been a mistake. I said, she said, where'd you get it from? I was like, over there. So the lady just went ahead and rang me up for a dollar. I said, well, let me go back and get some more. So I guess the lady was going to put her son aside. I got three more colors. I wear t-shirts in the winter because at work I get hot. So I can always like come in with a coat or a sweater on and you know, of course take that off, get to work and I'll warm up. And so I got brown, just a basic like round neck tee. And I think these were similar to some ones I got from Target. Y'all, here's the dollar sticker. 
And that was a reason, another reason that made me go into Walmart. It's this young lady I follow on Instagram. And she was showing that she had a Walmart sale. She had got some stuff from Walmart for a sale. And something was a dollar, but she was smaller than me. She's too lost weight. And so I was just like, okay, it went over my head. But baby, they and I couldn't find anything. Like she had like a whole short suit set. And I was like, I, I don't have no way to wear that too. So I wasn't even thinking about that. But anyway, another dollar. So I paid one, two, three, four dollars for t-shirts. And I'm sure these t-shirts, I think they were ringing up. They were on the table for five. So I got five for the price of one. Another dollar. Black. I, I, I look, okay, I know I got black t-shirts, but yeah. Then here's the gray one. I don't have a lot of gray, but I got, I was like, I'm sure I got some like gray sweats or something. I can just throw this on with. And so, that, oh, one more thing, y'all. Hold on. Listen, listen. I'm not spraying this because I haven't had my shower yet, but listen, this came in the mail yesterday. It is from Fleur Vanilla Skin. It went viral on TikTok. So, what sold me on it was, and I, oh, that's another thing. I also got this Yara off of TikTok. Now, this smells good. It's gonna giving you like vanilla candy. I'm into my vanilla era. I don't know why I'm into this vanilla era my husband cannot stand it i don't care i like it and so it's like a vanilla musk with a little hint of sweetness to it smells good but it does not last okay fine i use this to kind of just get out the door and if i'm going to the grocery store or run errands okay then this went viral and i kept seeing it but then when i seen i think it's either Alyssa or Amon Ashley, one of the twins, talk about it and she was describing it like to a T. I was like, that's me, that's me. Let me go ahead and order it. Y'all, it was, I can't remember, it's it's the travel size. I can't remember, I don't think I paid a lot for it, but when I went back, I said, let me put this back in my basket. It was $24. Then she had one that was called Missing Persons, but it was just, she said that one was really good. It was just a little small travel size, but that was 29. I said, well, we gonna leave that one there. This smells amazing. I When I got it in the mail yesterday, let me tell you. I'm going to try to describe it like she did. I found it on Amazon, but Amazon had it cheaper. They had two trial sizes for $19.99. One trial size is $24 on TikTok Shop. So if you want it, go over to TikTok Shop, Amazon. I did link it in my Amazon storefront, y'all. It's giving vanilla. It's giving musk. It's giving smoke. It's giving spice. It's everything that she said it was. Oh my God. So when I got it yesterday, I had came home. It was in the mailbox. I didn't take y'all with me, but I was trying to make, and I didn't show y'all, but I was trying to make a, a tortilla wrap. What is it called? I don't know. I was trying to make a chicken wrap. And I thought I had some tortillas and I was like, nope, let me just go back out and get the tortillas, you know, and some more corn. So I just... So hmm, let me see what it smells like. Sprayed it on. When I, y'all, this stuck with me all night long. It's totally different from the Yara. The Yara smells great, but this here, when you take the cap off, my gosh. I mean, it's giving musk now. It's a heavy on the musk, but definitely in the vanilla. I mean, all of the things. It's vanilla, musk, smoky. I don't even know if it has notes on here. Oh, it does. Let's see. The note says, Pink pepper, pink apple, sugar, what? It's hard for me to read. Sugar, something. Heat, heart, excuse me. Lily, jasmine. Oh, God. I can't read to the bottle because it's so dark, but listen. And the bottle is giving cute, okay? I, I have, an, like I said, I got it in my Amazon cart and I put it in my Amazon storefront and I got it in my cart on TikTok because I'm like, I got to go back and get it. I got to go back and get it. Like it's giving fall, very fall fragrancy. I've been into this fragrance that I actually have another fragrance coming from TikTok. So when I was talking about, I'm hoping that it, it smells great as well. Y'all. Okay. But I just wanted to show y'all my quick haul. I'm going to try this bra on 
And I'm kind of thankful that I got the, it stretches. So I'm kind of thankful that I got the 40, let me make sure I got the right one. Because I might have went with the 38 double D because I think they said you can get your side. I did. I did get 38 double D. I got 38 double D. So I think it's going to fit. I'm going to try that on. But today, I think I'm going to throw everything in here. I'm doing, of course, all black. I got to go to work. I'm going to do some all black. My little black, little platform kind of shoes. And just all black. And I could do this shirt. I like to wash my clothes first. Sometimes I don't get to. I'm not going to even hold you. But um, I keep, I, I got clean black t-shirts. So that pair of leggings that, you know, I could throw on a jean jacket or a jean top. Because it is a little rainy here today. But that is it y'all i just wanted to show y'all um and it came with a little duster this little dust bag i don't need it <laughs> so i'm gonna put this stuff up to be washed i do have some laundry to fold um, my husband's going fishing today but i have a full day of work i'm probably gonna get off to 10 o'clock tonight so um this is like my morning where i drink coffee you know i haven't had no breakfast i need to pack my lunch for work all that great stuff so but I just wanted to show y'all this quick haul. I think I said it, but I've been just trying to get mainly tops because I don't mind if my tops are a little big if I lose weight. But um, I really wasn't trying to buy no pants. But when I saw these and then I said, okay, I love these so much. I had a pair of shorts just like these. I don't know what I did with them, but it was back when I was like a 14. And I'm like, oh, if I lose weight, I'm going to take them to my seamstress lady and I'm going to have her adjust these. And guess what, y'all? I'm five three and a half. Okay, let's just gonna say five three. Whatever. I'm five three and a half. And these fit. The length on them is perfect. Like they're they're not too long, and they're definitely not short. But I don't want to get them adjusted. Like I've had my lady like him a lot of stuff for me, especially if I get it from like Shein, Fashion Nova, places like that these she won't have to touch she's not gonna have to touch these until i lose some weight and want them to you know really really fit and then i think even like if i lost 10 20 more pounds these still are going to fit they're going to be loose like i like them so i am excited but that is my haul i gotta find the piece for my camera so i can start putting it on the tripod so right now it is no use to me okay um i did a whole video but anyway long story short I wanted to tell y'all about my outfit today. I have on the pants from Walmart. Listen, listen. Oh my God, I don't think I know my size. I have room. They're a little baggy like I want them. I was gonna do an outfit of the day. I, I just, I, I, I don't feel like y'all. I've had a long day. But I've had, the, the, the pants fit perfect. They got room in them. I slid them on without having to unzip them. Okay. And I was going to wear one of the green tops that I had gotten. But I was like, I know I got a beige top. I don't know what's on my top. But I was like, I know I got a beige top. Like, I think a beige color would go better. Okay. I was like, yes, this is perfect. I got so many compliments on this outfit today. But let me get in here so I can eat my crabs. Let me show you my crabs. We got crabs. We got crabs. So yeah, and my strawberries, I'm just gonna put them right on the side. So I'm getting ready to go in here and um, take these clothes off. That's why I said like, y'all won't probably get an outfit of the day, but just trust, beautiful. Um, I'm going in here and eat my crabs, make my little dessert, put some house clothes on, excuse me, and call it a day.
I have been to every TJ Maxx in PG County and looking for this pot. I found it in Georgetown. I'm too excited. My husband is probably done with me because I have been in stores, but I'm loving it. Oh, it's a smaller one too. That might be the one I'm looking for. Hold on. Here's a smaller one. Oh my God. Yep, just the one. This is the one I wanted, the smaller one. So I'm getting this and I'm leaving because my husband is like, this way too much money. Let me go find him because he's looking at the cologne in here now. Somebody wanna drop more to me. <laughs> Put an Adidas one right there. <laughs> okay you guys, we are back. I got Debbie in the car with me. So I won't be doing a car haul today like I normally do because I got hubby, but y'all, we enjoyed ourselves. We had a great day and I'm supposed to be on my way to a cookout, but that's fading real fast. But we went to Sephora, TJ Maxx. What was that up here? Up in smoke. <laughs> <laughs> no, TJ Maxx, Sephora. Oh, H&M, H&M. We're heading home. I'm going home to drop hubby off. And then I'm gonna go to this cookout I'm supposed to be going to. We're starting a new vlog, so welcome to the vlog. Honey, what you supposed to say? Welcome to Subscribe the Subscribe to the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're supposed to say like, comment, and Like, comment, and subscribe. To the what? To the vlog. Okay, okay. All right, we'll see you later. Hey guys, so we are back and I'm just gonna show you what I got because I gotta get ready for this cookout, which I'm super late to, but I'd rather spend the time with my husband. Um, let's start with, we went into Sephora first. My husband was looking at cologne. I was looking at, um, I went in just for this one size primer. It is the oil sucker. And I haven't been wearing makeup because I sweat it all. I've tried the one side spray. That really wasn't working for me, the Charlotte Tillsbury. So I really like putting my foundation on. So that's the reason I was going to get this so that I could go to the cookout with some makeup on and hoping that it would last. And then I also, it's like fish. I also had tested the K. Ali Vanilla Sugar. I wanted to smell it first. So I want to see how it sits with my skin, but I've been wanting it, but I was like, before I purchase it, I have to send it back. Let me just see what it smells like. Interesting. Then I got this Jo Malone collection. It's the samples of all of them because I've heard of like people buying it, but I didn't know exactly which one. So I wanted to just kind of get a sample of everything and that way I can know. I'm just in my little fragrance area right now, whatever. Then, so also I wanted to try the pink powder. So they have the sample size. And so I got that. It's the pink loose setting powder. I'm excited about this, excited to try that. But the main thing was this, the oil sucker. That's what I really wanted, I was going for. And that was all I was gonna get. Then I heard about that this was, I think it went viral. Um, Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm Stick in Blazed Donut. And I thought it was like a lip gloss, which she said it is, but it looked like a lipstick. So this is it. But it looks like this. She said it is a gloss. It's shiny. Mm. Definitely need a liner. She was trying to sell me the liner. I have a liner. I have a liner that's closer to like my complexion and to what she was trying to sell me. So that's that. <clears throat> and then I had some points. So I got, I don't even want to mess it up. <laughs> and this is what it looks like. It's um, 
a cream retinol oil and plant collagen. So I got that. Mm, got a smell to it, a little old lady kind of smell, but <clears throat> normally that stuff is good. So I think I am gonna rock this lip today. I'm just gonna put a liner on with it. Then H&M, what I went looking for in H&M was like this leopard dress, but I'll probably find it at the outlets. That's fine. But I did come across, well first, I got these earrings. Now I like to get my little costume jewelry from Shein because it's cheaper. These are probably on Shein for a dollar. But I needed some silver earrings because I have some silver jewelry and I just can't find my silver earrings and stuff. So or either I'll do like diamond studs. But I just wanted something that's a little small, kind of like what I got on. And I think I got these from Shein. But so I got these. Um and then I got just some basic, see, it's the same color. You know what? Anyway, I had put one back because it was just like kind of what I got on. So I got this, just some basic t-shirts with the, like, you know, the jersey kind of stretch. This, now here's the thing, I was gonna get a large, but I think I got the extra large. I did, I, get the, I got the extra large because I do want just a little room and I know that I'm gonna lose weight, so that's fine. And I did get the extra large and this one. <clears throat> I had some of those, like it's a jersey, like wide leg pants, like jogging suit, but it's a wide leg, and I, to pair with these. But I put that back because I was just like, not right now, you know, same color, but it's just a different material. I wasn't thinking this is the same thing I got on. I'm, I'm a neutrals girl, but so then we went to TJ Maxx. And probably wanted some cologne out of there as well. I was just browsing. But as I was browsing, y'all, I got... I'm looking over there because I made breakfast this morning, so the match to this is on the stove. I finally got the pan. So I have the saucepan, this little pot. And there is actually a bigger one. There was a bigger one, but I was like, I do have some that size that I like. It, I could have bought that, but I was just like, I, I don't really need that. I want this right here. And so I have the pan. So now, to me, that's pretty much all I need. Sam's had them, like the whole set for like 150. I thought about getting that, but I was just like, this is really all I need. So again, if you don't know, Marshalls, I originally found them in Marshalls, but the Caraway set, which I was gonna get on Prime, they for that whole pot set it was like three four hundred dollars and uh these are just like the dupes to the caraway and so they are non-stick i love them um i gotta figure out how to clean my bottle on my other one and this one was uh 24.99 so that's it y'all i gotta get off because i gotta go to this cookout and i was gonna change my clothes because i was not gonna wear this this was we started with running out to go to take some fish to my aunts that my husband had caught. Why are you looking at me like that? Don't say it. <laughs> anyway, he had caught some, he went fishing on Friday. He caught some fish. So we took them to my aunt's house, <clears throat> dropped them off. And so we was like, well, let's just keep going. So that's how we ended up in Georgetown. And he was like, well, I can go to the Sephora there. So we just kept going because I was going to go to Sephora in Virginia. So we just had a good little time. And, um, yeah, so now I got to get changed and ready. So I think I'm just going to throw some water. I was going to change my outfit because I actually had this one yesterday. So I was going to change my outfit, but because this was just to run out, not to, <laughs> not to be shopping. And so, but now I'm like, I don't have time because the cookout started at 3 o'clock. It's 4.32. So I think I'm fine. I think I'm just going to wet my hair down and... Uh, Put this on and put just a little bit of makeup on and then we'll be out the door y'all and i'm not going to stay at the cookout long because i can't drive that i guess i can't drive that well but i don't like to drive in the dark so that is it hubby you want to tell a vlog bye, bye. <laughs>
Okay, y'all, I am almost done, but I realized that my mascara is in my purse. So I'll do that like in the car. But y'all, that oil sucker is so dry in my face. It sucked my face dry. So I wanna put this on to bring it back to life. And I'm a little scared to use this because I'm like, if it's that dry, I don't want my face to be like super dry. And my lip, all that, I have the lip, but the lip um, liner is in my purse too. I do keep lip liner, mascara for my little everyday and my little, I wouldn't even use my correct brow thing. So this going in my purse, yes ma'am. Mm. Okay, they said it. So, I wish I could do mascara. Let me see, because sometimes I'll have an extra mascara, but I don't think that I do. Okay, nonetheless, it's time for some highlight. Just a little bit. Let me find that spray. And I was looking for my MAC spray. I actually did some makeup yesterday for one of my customers. Even though I have retired from doing makeup, she asked me to do her makeup, so I did it. So I know I had it. Oh, and this is the MAC. This is so old. As you can see, it's probably in a holiday collection. It is Whisper of Guilt, my favorite highlighter of all time. And it's old, and I'm, I'm using it, okay? So I'll put my mascara on in the car, but I am for extra layer of protection. I'm gonna go ahead and add the Charlotte Tillsbury, um, Tillsbury Airbrush Setting Spray. Okay, because I had to bring it back to skin light. So this will be my test to see how that oil sucker works. I'm gonna put that in my main bag. And then I couldn't find, I found the foundation I wanted to use, but I had to keep in mind that I've gotten a tan. So this was, when I bought it, it was too dark, so that came in perfect. But the one that I wanted to use, here it is, it was down here, because this also is just a little darker than my complexion. This is House Labs. I love that one. That one is beautiful. It is actually probably one of my favorites. So I'm gonna throw these away. Oh, and I did like the pink setting powder, so I'm just gonna throw, because I know I'm gonna keep the pink setting powder, the lip, everything that I got. Oh, I'm taking that with me. I'm debating, I don't think I need this because that oil sucker, I couldn't even move my face. So this is it, y'all. Um, oh, I didn't wet my hair. Oh my. I'm gonna have to go looking like this because if I wet it, it's gonna look worse. Plus, I want to throw some relaxer and stuff like that on it this week. So, that is it. I will see y'all in the car. Yo, I thought I was recording. I just put on mascara in the car. My, you know, it was in my purse. I didn't get to wet my hair. Um, I think I got powder on my shirt, but it's okay. Okay, you guys, so I'm about to pull up to this cookout. It's still sun outside, but I don't like the sun when it's set. It only took me about an hour. At first, it's like an hour and 20 minutes, but it only took me like an hour. My lady is still on, so um, I'll try to get some footage, but I can't say that I will because I'm at someone's house. You know what I mean? I think it's at 107. Um, I'm at someone else's house, so, you know, we'll see. Um, it was something else I had to share with y'all. I don't Oh, I you ain't arrived. Eating. Destination oh. is on your left. Okay, I see that. I haven't eaten. So, what am I gonna eat? I wonder if I can park right here. I can park right here. Here you go. I got me some food. I got me a turkey burger. Some, what is this, tuna chop? No, ma'am. He got, he got like a hybrid, he got a car line. Oh, okay. Oh, what's a cooler? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I need something to drink. I had some water. That's the best of all. You can get some that get you back. Oh, no, I get it. Oh yeah, these mosquitoes ain't playing. Yeah, that's why I'm putting this on my back. I just hopped on, I'm home, praise goodness, I'm home, but look at my makeup. This is from my glasses. Oh, that's the only thing I hate. But anyway, look at my makeup. It's still intact. Uh, bags though. So I'm gonna really take this off and go to bed, but I am thoroughly impressed. Now I did start sweating. And I, I thought about it. I should have put the primer a little closer to my hairline. I tried to put it in places where I sweat, which I call my mustache, my forehead, and then like right in here. But other than that, it held up pretty good. So I think it's a winner. I think the oil sucker is a winner. Also, I realized I should have probably put a little, I have a blurring stick by another brand, but um, I should, I'm gonna think I'm gonna get the blurring stick from them from one size and see how that do or the blurring whatever it is but i know i wasn't going long but y'all my face is so matte like even after i sprayed it it's so matte it's not a lot of transfer but yeah i think i would follow up with the one size spray but it is looking good yeah so i'll definitely be using that again Hey you guys, so today is Monday, September the 2nd. I'm at work mm -mm. and I just finished my customers for the day. Oops, I need to put this back. I just finished my customers for the day and I'm heading home. But I, I kind of feel like I need to go to um, Target because I think I saw some wine glasses there. And then I'm looking for wine glasses. I know. I don't. Yo, I don't even drink wine like that. So that's why I'm like, Yoshida, you're doing too much. But it was those, okay, those plates that I got from Target. There are some smaller plates. Like, they're bigger than a saucer, though. I want those as well. So I kind of want to do that. And how about my customer gave me a $55 tip for working on a holiday? That's why, I, baby, I work on holidays. I will work on a holiday. So now I'm trying to decide, and I kind of want to go to Sam's because my sister sent me a picture of the Quest chips in the boxes at Sam's. So I kind of want to check that out. Y'all, I'm so pissed. I have on all white today, and I, I relaxed my hair. I got relaxed on here, and now I can't get it off. Y'all want to see the outfit because we have a full mirror, and being that I'm the only one here, um, you can see my outfit. Um, let me see if I can turn it around as well. Well, hold on. Go to the bathroom. So this is my outfit, my $5 sweatpants from Target that, um, you know, that I got. I think I told y'all about these pants, jogging pants. And these are the mediums, and this is how they're fit to me. And then this is my TikTok shop tank. There's Judy. And then actually these shoes I thrifted. So this is my fit. This is what I was supposed to wear to the cookout, but baby time did not permit. And I'm glad I didn't because I would have had on makeup and it would have got in the way. But this is my fit. And I almost did like a another top um, from Walmart. They said track and feel. But yeah, this is the fit. Okay. Um, oh, 
of the accessories I have. These are the earrings I got yesterday from H&M. And then this necklace, I uh, believe again, is from Shein. Please excuse this. So that necklace is from Shein. And yeah, so I'm going to go so I can kind of enjoy the rest of the day. I don't have no plans. But now my client gave me this tip. I'm going to go put this in the bank because I got some bills to pay. And I got to take care of something for the budget box. Did I unplug everything? I did. Let me make sure. I can over there. Hold on. Oh, and let me see if I can prop it all up. I don't know if I showed y'all my newest shades. Did I wear these yesterday? Because I have two pair. These. But I thought the black ones would go better. Like, this is cute, but, and I love oversized glasses. These are cute. But I like the black ones better because the black shoes, the accessories. And I'm still carrying this bag. But guess what? It really kind of goes together. Like, it's in a neutral family. Okay, I'm wrapping. I'm fully checking to make sure I got my keys. I turn down the air. And yeah, I got my keys. So I'm trying to decide what I'm gonna do, but I think I'm gonna need to just go over to the bank, make my deposit and pay my bills. So I will holler at you guys later. Oh, oh so these are the glass shades I was talking about. Ooh, baby. Yes. I like these. Yo, believe it or not, these came from the beauty supply store. They, um, had picked up this another pair like this in black so the rim was thicker on the black ones than these but I said I like these better they're a little lighter okay you guys so my light went out I had to recharge it so that's why every the last couple of clips was dark but I got these I, I think I showed y'all these and I got them from Target today I don't know if something that I can't get with. And it's made from chicken breast, egg whites, and chicken broth. And it's kind of given chicken. So to make this a high protein meal, I'm just going to add my protein chips, which, oh, I was gonna say this is my last bag. Right. And I almost got some more day. Let me send my grace. So I'm going to, this is dinner, it's 521. I had a little Lunchable that I made for my lunch today. I made this the other day. This was stuffed, so I couldn't use all the chicken, but it's more protein if I used all the chicken. But, and this meal was like, ooh, 40 something grams of protein. But with the corn, the cauliflower, cauliflower, all the mixings together, it was almost 700 calories. But that particular day, I hadn't eaten a lot like today. So I'm good with it. But I wanted to make my own Chipotle burrito. So you guys. If I haven't said it already today is Monday the 2nd. It's Labor Day. This is my Labor Day meal. And I'm going to end the vlog here. Because I want to chill for the rest of the day because supposedly I'm off tomorrow. So hopefully I'm off tomorrow. And I just want to relax, chill with hubby. And that's it. And I clean my kitchen. I gotta do a little bit more cleaning to it. So I just wanna sit, enjoy my meal. Don't wanna be always eating when I'm talking to y'all. So thank you guys for watching. If you have not already, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. I always forget to say that. And if you're new here, welcome. And we do these from time to time, just a little bit more than usual. But yeah, I'm gonna enjoy my dinner and I will see you guys in the next one.